A warning for drivers in New Jersey. Watch out for deer. It's mating season, and that means more sightings. CBS 2's Nick Calloway spoke to drivers who've had close calls. Even in the most densely populated state in the country, New Jersey residents are accustomed to seeing deer just about everywhere. <coughs> Even if the pets are not. But as the mating season for deer gets underway, they are more likely to cross roads and highways, increasing danger for drivers. They are very lovely, but uh, we have to be careful. Call him blessed, but Father Aziz John Hadodo of New Milford has never hit one. Time to time we see some that hit by cars, but so far I've been lucky I haven't hit any. Pino and Julie cannot say the same. I was one of the lucky ones, let's put it that way. A buck ran in front of his car last fall. Hit him, bounced, his body landed across, and his antlers ended up here. And Julie owns RSR Auto Body Restoration in Wyckoff. This time of year, plenty of customers are coming in with costly deer damage. I mean, it can be anywhere from 6,000 to over 20,000. It's a similar scene 20 minutes to the west in Wayne. Paul Miller Performance Collision Center gets two to five deer hit customers a week lately. This BMW SUV is one of them. It's going to be ranging between 10 and 15,000, and I think it was hit at a low speed. Manager Al Grazioli says on top of the cost, there's a struggle to get parts because of the broken supply chain. We have cars here now. I mean, we're waiting for headlights. It's been three months coming out of Germany. And it's a big inconvenience for customers. State estimates indicate there are more than 125,000 deer in the Garden State. Each year, there are thousands of collisions between us and them. Most of those wrecks taking place this time of year. In Waldwick, New Jersey, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News. Now, peak mating season for deer in New Jersey runs from late October to mid-December, so slow down, especially around dawn and sunset.